Hey, CF listeners, hear about the latest trends in the travel industry with the brand USA Talks Travel Podcast. Right now, listen to special live from IPW interviews featuring U.S. Travel's Jeff Freeman. DMOs are at the heartbeat of U.S. Travel. Liz Bittner from Travel South. A lot of key gateway markets are back. L.A. Tourism's Adam Burke. We all win when we all partner together. Plus, brand USA's Stacey Melman and Jackie Ennis with international travel trends and Chris Thompson's farewell finale. I'm Mark Lapidus. Join us for brand USA Talks Travel on your favorite podcast platform. Brand USA Talks Travel. Good morning from Skift. For daily updates in your inbox, subscribe to the Skift Daily Newsletter at skift.com slash daily. It's Tuesday, May 17th in New York City. And now here's what you need to know about the business of travel today. Marriott International announced on Monday it will launch a media network to enable advertisers to reach its guests via the company's app and room TVs, writes senior hospitality editor Sean O'Neill. O'Neill reports that Marriott and advertisers will test out the media network in the U.S. and Canada over the next two weeks, while the company will use customer data from past searches and reservations made on its platforms to allow brands to display ads relevant to travelers. Marriott said it wouldn't share consumer or loyal loyalty program information, such as names and addresses. The hotel giant will use Yahoo as a tech partner, with advertisers shopping for ad inventory via Yahoo's portal and sales team. However, it's uncertain when Marriott will unveil a program enabling it to display advertisements on TVs and guest rooms and hotel lobbies. We go to Latin America next. The region has seen a major resurgence in group travel, which has resulted in an enormous boost in business for its travel agents, reports contributor Paula Krizanovic. Krizanovic writes that extended family and friends traveling together, as well as graduation trips and the rise of destination weddings, are sparking the sector's recent boom in Latin America. Group travel currently represents close to 40% of the vacation trips taken in Latin America. That's a huge increase from the 10 to 15% figure recorded prior to the pandemic, according to Argentina-based market research and tourism marketing firm Promover. The surge in group travel has also led to more travel agents across Latin America returning to their offices. Andrea Tosi, Promover's founder and communications manager, said a sense of urgency is driving more consumers to look for in-person assistance from agents, with many travelers eager to go on trips quickly that would have often taken a long time to prepare in the past. Finally, Ryanair CEO Michael O'Leary believes the United Kingdom is responsible for its travel staffing shortages due to what he calls its inflexible labor market following its departure from the European Union two years ago, writes Airlines reporter Edward Russell. While the Ireland-based carrier itself isn't experiencing staffing issues, O'Leary said on Monday that there is a shortage of airport and catering employees across the UK, especially in locations that Ryanair flies to, such as Glasgow, Bristol and Manchester. He added the labor shortage will pose major challenges for the UK travel industry, with the country unable to bring in young European workers as it had prior to Brexit. For more travel stories and deep dives into the latest trends, head to skiff.com. To find these stories and more insight into the business of travel, subscribe to the Skift Daily newsletter at skift.com slash daily. Spoken Layer Hey, CF listeners, hear about the latest trends in the travel industry with the brand USA Talks Travel Podcast. Right now, listen to special live from IPW interviews featuring U.S. Travel's Jeff Freeman. DMOs are at the heartbeat of U.S. Travel. Liz Bittner from Travel South. A lot of key gateway markets are back. L.A. Tourism's Adam Burke. We all win when we all partner together. Plus, brand USA's Stacey Melman and Jackie Ennis with international travel trends and Chris Thompson's farewell finale. I'm Mark Lapidus. Join us for brand USA Talks Travel on your favorite podcast platform. Brand USA Talks Travel.